Well, Coach Powell, let's talk about you and the family over Thanksgiving. Did you have a good Thanksgiving? Definitely did. You know, got a chance to be around family, uh, take a day off to kind of get away from basketball, watch a little bit of football. But it was a blessed time. Definitely a thankful day. Well, then let's look at the team itself. And because you've had a long layout between the last game that you had against Grand Rapids and now tonight against Cleveland and kind of give an evaluation of the time that you had off during that span. Uh, we got a chance to kind of fine tune a lot of things, uh, go over some stuff, install some different things. So we feel like, you know, over that two week break that we had, we really use it to our advantage to, you know, get sharp on some things and tighten some things up. So then how about some of the off court things? Are there some important things you were able to do off court with the guys and kind of get them integrated into the community? Uh, we went to great shots here as a team. You know, uh, some of the guys we've been rotating with going in the community to go to different schools. So, you know, we've been trying to do the best job we can with just getting our guys in the community. And that two-week break, we really used it to, to get after some of that stuff and get ourselves out in the community. How about when you have a long layoff like that, it does give you the opportunity to get people healthy. How are things looking in that department? Uh, right now, that's a great thing. You know, we definitely use that to get everybody healthy. Everybody was kind of nicked up and banged up. So, you know, that time definitely helped us and, and got guys closer to 100%. So then what do we look at tonight with the Cleveland Charge? Do you see some similarities between your team and theirs? Uh, you know, two different teams. I think they're talented. Uh, obviously, they, they have Taco Fall on the inside, which could be a problem. They got R.J. Nimhard, who's a great guard, Malik Newman, who was with us before. So, you know, this league is full of talented guys, and this is a team that's talented. We just got to make sure we stay connected and, and we play together to win this game. Then look at rebounding. Is that one going to be the important keys for tonight's game? Definitely. You know, for us, that's always something we want to win, the battle on the boards. And I just think uh, making an effort one through five, crashing the glass, um, that rebounding battle is going to be something that we definitely look forward to winning. What about the 50-50 balls? And, and rebounding is part of that, but then there's the hustle on the other on the other parts of the game. Like you say, it starts with the rebounding, and I think that will lead to getting those 50-50 balls. But it's going to be a dog fight, and, and we got to be able to go in there and get those 50-50 balls. What about maintaining defensive aggression, but kind of scaling back on the fouling? For sure, that's something we also worked on, you know, still being uh, disruptive and really getting after guys, but play without fouling and playing, being disciplined on defense, you know, that's a big part of it. So, you know, we're going to go out there, try to be as disruptive as possible and play without fouling. All right. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.